Like I have to ask you, um, even though everybody saw the clip and we're all fantastic members uh, of this show, of all the things you had to connect with Peter, how in the world did you connect Shakespeare's writings to the code to Oak Island? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, I wish that uh, I could say that I did this and I did that, but uh, of course it was not uh, like that at all because uh, from the 1930s there has been this theory that Shakespeare has been connected with Oak Island and I watched a video with Mark Finland whom we, we saw in this video clip that you had and mm. he talked about this theory which I then thought was a little bit crazy, I must <laughs> admit, but in the same video, I also saw Fred Nolan describing his cross and mm -hmm. immediately I, I noticed the possibility that this could be part of the tree of life. And uh, about six months later, I was working with Shakespeare and I saw that uh, there was this possible Rosicrucian connection with Shakespeare, and I knew that mm -hmm. um, the Rosicrucians were uh, uh, into the Kabbalah. Mm -hmm. And then it began to be less crazy, so I was uh, connecting the dots, more or less. I, I did not discover the, the Shakespearean connection at all, but I helped to build a bridge between Shakespeare's writings and the island and also trying to pinpoint where we should uh, focus our attention. Right. 